Hey guys, it's just a short little video here. I'm pacing around the house in the living room for a minute. I'm trying to figure out where to put my little camera stand thingy. <clears throat> Anyways, um, I'm doing a short little video here of the different items I have. I kind of fidget items. <clears throat> Many of which you guys have seen. This one is one of my favorites. Absolutely. Um, this little flashing worm. The airs now come out of him and everything. So, but I mean, he still lights up. This little, little ball in him right here, he lights up. So, this thing, this thing's pretty cool, because it does light up, and then, you know, he just... They're funny when they have the air in them. There's a lot of just glue with that. We can fill this air again. But anyways, yeah. This thing is like one of the funniest things because... One of the funniest things because it's so tactile. It has all these little things. Little hair-like structures. His eyeballs are now fading off like crazy. Once in a while, I'll just kind of carry it around, just, just swinging it or just whatever with my hands, as you can see right now. It's a beautiful day outside, and I'm inside because I cannot really go outside because of my lupus. <coughs> um, autoimmune disease. Yeah, sadly. But, anyways, this is just one of the little things that I kind of carry around once in a while and just goof around with it. As you can see, me going crazy here with it. I was just swinging back and forth and go like that, and then I'll do, do that and whatever. But there's that one, and I won this, I won like a bunch of these out of a, a machine. The Knobby Ball. Little ball I won from the arcade. You guys just scroll down my list of videos a bit. You'll see that I played Tekken 3, which was really, really, really fun. I tried videoing and playing the game at the same time, so I uploaded that video a couple days ago. <coughs> Hope you all had a wonderful St. Patrick's Day because I know I did. Really good at winning these out of the claw machines until they blow them up like bigger than the claw machines and I can't. Do it. Doesn't work out. <clears throat> so there's those two items, and I haven't shown you guys this one. And yes, um, I hope you kind of I hope you can read my shirt because I love it. Don't interrupt me when I'm talking to myself. As you guys know, I'm I do YouTube videos, so of course I talk to myself or the camera, you know, you guys. So this is one of the cool little um other things I have. It's called a chew uh card, some sort of stick. Chew stick, I believe. It's got four sides to it. It's got this side. Uh, it's got this side that I always bite with the little bumps. Um, I haven't been able to bite through it. And of course, it's a two in one, so you can like. Is it, um, you can bite it. And you can, and you can also have it as a hand fidget. One or the other. Or both two in one, so. Anyways, that's pretty cool. This is the only side of a bite. I don't, I've tried biting the other ones enough. This one that my it slipped and like hit my gums and so I'm like ah oh, crud that hurt. Uh, anyways, yeah, I got that little um that ball right there that I won, and I have the what to do with that thingy? Where'd it go? I oh this thing is awesome. As you've seen, probably me just goofing around with it. I'll fling it like that sometimes and then just have it. Flying around like that, and then I'll just have it 
in my video. I can only hold the camera. And I will just go like this with it. So, I mean, it's pretty cool. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Yeah, just go like that and then I'll fling it around and whatnot. And so. So, this guy is pretty cool. It's one of those wiggly worms. Got it off Amazon. So, that's, that's a plus. Fling them around and everything, just toss them. This is the little hair like fillings he has here. Kind of cool. Sort of puffed up, kind of puffed, was puffed up with air, but the air is just going to come out of the little hole. But you could like attach a string or a rubber band to him and just, you know, carry it around, whatever. <laughs> that was. Just made a noise, and the air is coming out right here. It says, uh, what is it? Gooey, gooey. I can't see what that says. Gooey, I think. Anyways, got it off this guy off Amazon. One of the best buys. <laughs> Love it. Because <clears throat> it's so tactile and versatile. And now I've got... <clears throat> you guys have seen this thing. Oh, Wiggly worm. Here's his little face. Little eyeballs. Hello. Not many legs. Just another fun fidget item. You can kind of fling like that. So this one's kind of fun too. You'll just hold it and just go like that. Got little, also got little hair like structures on him. And this little guy here, as you can see, he's like my little blue dinosaur I had about a couple months ago at my dollar store. This one doesn't light up or nothing, but it's pretty cool. I like this, um, this little caterpillar, this little face, it just has eyes. But two of these I got um, this green one, and I have a red one. Which I don't have on me. At least I don't. I don't think. And then so there's this one. You guys have seen this bead ball. It's like a little rubber ball filled with um little little beads. Got this one also off Amazon. <clears throat> I'll go like that to get it back to normal, and then squish it all over again, but whatever. One thing to just toss up and down the air. Let's see. So I had to buy new sunglasses. The last ones, I ended up losing a little thing off of them at the park, so. Whenever I go out, I wear these now, these black ones. Which I must say, they actually look pretty cool. Give everything sort of a tint to it. And you guys have seen my um, delightful. Also, it lights up like the purple thing here. This one is a light up starfish, but it's filled with goo and gel, like gooey. It's kind of reminds you of like looks reminds you of like orange hair gel. I squished it earlier and it made a weird noise. It's like if you smack it or slam it down on something, it'll start flashing. And there we go. Ta-da! Anyways, I won't do that one too long. And, uh, I got my Tingle Fidget. This one's the velvety one, covered in velvet. You guys have seen most of these. My other collection I have of the videos of lots of these. I ordered a green one for my friend, and because her son figured she might help him in class. So... You have these things help with autism, OCD, um, people with old people, um, you know, not, well, just anybody. I mean, 
kids are those. Obviously, you're not going to want to give it to, like, your two-year-old because they can pop the pieces. Some of the pieces will pop off, and then they will come apart. But some of the pieces don't come apart, so you might break it. But they connect by this little thing here and this little thing. They can connect together. There's your pain to get back together. Sometimes they are, sometimes they're not. <clears throat> Anyways, um, this one's got like velvet, and then once the velvet starts coming off, it turns all shiny and almost like the plastic. People with um, people who have like carpet tunnel and what you um, wrist hand therapy should use these, and you know with OCD, you know, keep your hands busy and doing stuff, so those are pretty good, thank you guys for watching my little video here, on some of my different little items I got here comment, like, share, subscribe thank you, bye